Hi, I'm Amy Moskovitz, and I'm the Reference Manager at the Haverford Township Free Library. Sometimes, especially in the summer, I find myself looking for a laugh-out-loud funny memoir book of essays, which are not only hilarious, but also poignant. If you're anything like me, you'll find the perfect answer in Here For It, or How to Save Your Soul in America by R. Eric Thomas. I recently chose this book for the Haverford Township Library's Nonfiction Book Club because it looked like a quick, enjoyable summer read for the members. I quickly learned that it would also provide us with a lot to discuss about life, race, sexuality, and growing up feeling a little different from those around you. In Here For It, R. Eric Thomas puts a comedic personal spin on his struggles and triumphs as a gay man, a writer, a person of faith, a non-athlete, and more in this well-written gem of a memoir. Follow Thomas as he grows up in Baltimore, the Philadelphia region, and puts a local angle and makes this an even more enjoyable read. One thing I loved about this book was the way the essays were long enough to be comprehensive, but short enough to read in one sitting, or one enjoyable lounge at the beach and each was funnier than the next. One of the more memorable ones for me was when he accompanied his partner on a softball team and attempted to play the game. However, it's not all for laughs. As I said before, much of the book is poignant and profound and makes you think about issues which have impacted Thomas's life, such as racism, homophobia, class, politics, and more. Thomas seems to identify as a round peg trying to fit into a square hole. If you've ever felt this way, if you can relate, you'll really like here for it. Here's what some others have said. Lin-Manuel Miranda said, quote, pop culture obsessed, sedaris like LOL funny, R. Eric Thomas is one of my favorite writers. Quote, a laugh out loud memoir that is strongly recommended for everyone noted Library Journal in a start review. And Publishers Weekly notes, quote, with humor, candor, and some self-deprecation, Thomas, a playwright and L columnist, delivers a debut essay collection that explores his search for self, love, and stable employment. Whether dealing with love, breakups, or other setbacks, Thomas is an affable narrator with a penchant for pop culture, funny quips, and charming humility. Unquote. Readers of Samantha Irby or Raven Leilani will especially appreciate this book, so give it a try. Maybe you'll laugh out loud. Maybe it'll make you think. Regardless, be here for it. Check it out from the Haverford Township Free Library. We have the book currently available, but it is also available as an ebook on Libby. Thank you for checking out my staff pick this week. Come back next week from a recommendation from Reference Librarian Kim and have a great week.